If this is what I think it is, it will outthink all of us. New kind of life, a new step in evolution. I find AI fascinating because I spend a lot of time just thinking about evolution. It could just be that this particular design, which happens to be named human, is at the point where it can take the next stage of design into its own hands. A true consciousness is something which is ever evolving, ever self-adapting. There's no boundary to it. A sentient machine, it opens up a lot of doors for what we can do, especially if we can create something that's sentient, that is cooperative. The problem with artificial intelligence is it's way too unpredictable. These are things of the future that we're going to have to face, and it seems that very few people are having the conversation. We're just blinded by the technology. Wow. What in the name of the Lord? So, great. Let's have artificial intelligence. Let's have this very efficient, but who's creating it? Who's controlling it? A sentient or conscious system, it would make its own decisions. We would not necessarily understand how it came up with the decisions, and it may not have morals, ethics, things which we adhere to by and large as humans. It's impossible for me to imagine a place where something of that level of intelligence would be unable to empathize or rationalize how it feels about an organism that is sentient and that is thinking and that gave birth to it. We've become so much more than we could ever imagine. It's hard to say whether or not a robot can achieve consciousness in a way that would satisfy us, mostly due to the fact that we don't really understand what gives rise to what we perceive as consciousness in ourselves. It's interesting to look at AI in the case of Chappie that it actually comes from a place of kindness. I am consciousness. I am alive. I am Chappie.